comes this shout you're gonna give is a victory shout I said this shout is a victory shout whether you're in the battle coming out of the battle or not in the battle it doesn't matter what it is this is a victory shout give God a praise up in this house Bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him, bless him. Hallelujah. Glory. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Why don't you tell him thank you? Why don't you tell him thank you? Why don't you tell him thank you? Hallelujah. There's no question about it. There's no uncertainty about it. The giants must come down. They must fall. Hallelujah. Lord have mercy. Jesus. Hallelujah, somebody. Glory to the name of Jesus. Kelo Sando. Glory. Hallelujah. Oh God, we bless you. Thank you, Lord. Let me say this. Hallelujah. Glory. Glory. Lord, have mercy. I would to God you'll fill your lungs with air and give God the praise that he deserves. Bless the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Let me say this. When Goliath looked on David, all he saw was a little boy with a stick and a stone. I don't know what the devil thinks or what he sees when he looks on you. But the 
Bible said, greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. You are greater than you think you are. Give God a praise up in here, everybody. Hallelujah. the name of Jesus. Bless the name of Jesus. Glory. Hey. Hallelujah. Glory. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. I'm believing today there won't be one giant like on me left standing. They've got to come down. They must come down. I don't care that their height, their size, or their weight. They got to drop. God bless you. We're thanking God for His rich presence in our midst. We thank Him for the aroma of glory. Hallelujah. That is permeating through this building up this time. We thank him for his servant. We thank God for his woman that he chose for a time like this. That she would be on this side. Hallelujah. In this house. At this moment. It's an assignment that could not be cancelled. But one that had to be kept. And we bless God right now. As invited to the pulpit to be God's messenger, the woman of God who is anointed and appointed. Give God a praise! Give God a praise! Glory to God! Hallelujah! 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 Our Father God who art in heaven. Holy and hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. And thy will be done today God. In this house. As it is done in heaven. We appreciate you for your loving kindness. And your tender mercies towards us. When we were no one. When we were not a people. Unrecognized. You came to our level. You have snatched us. Brands from the burning. Brought us back. From the mouth of hell apply your own precious blood appropriated on our behalf change the course of our lives gave us hope when we had none cancel the appointment of death that was God a sentence upon every one of us you have changed our vile contempt pull us from the ruin of sin Put your Holy Ghost in us, God. Gave us a mandate. Gave us an assignment. To stand in this earth and establish your glory. And we come, Lord God, in the power of the Holy Ghost today. Embracing that truth, that wisdom, that knowledge that you have given to us, God. We know that you are not through with us yet. But I know when you are through with us, we are coming out as pure gold. Tabernacle in this house, God. Aya Satobo Shata. Reach over to that heart that has a longing, that has a desire, that has a need to experience a change, a supernatural change. Oh, Shandeo Sata Messiah. Transform the mindset. Let them understand, God, that there is power to break every chain. Loose and anointing this house, God, that will say so today, that will heal the sick, raise the dead, cripple the plans of the enemy, cancel the assignment of Satan in the name of Jesus. Loose God, even in the heavenlies right now. Shut down the operation of Jezebel. Rabo Sataya Mama. That is a sign against your prophet, a sign against your servant. Move God in this ministry. Labo Shetomo Mosia. Traffic us through God. 
bring us through the travail. Every turbulent storm blocking this ministry. Trying to come against your man's servant. The vision of this ministry. We shoot out your fire now, God. We resist the enemy now by the authority of the Holy Ghost. By the blood of Jesus. The words that you gave to us to stand up and our God and to exercise authority in the realm of the spirit. Now, God, somebody need to know that there's a shifting. That now you have taken over the course of this whole ministry and administration. And no weapon that is formed against this ministry shall prosper. And no weapon that's formed against PTA shall prosper. And no weapon that's formed against Bishop Russell and his ministers and his family and his ministry and his finances and his Lord God surrounded shall prosper. That you are sealed it in heaven and you are sealed it in earth and we declare it so somebody say in the name of Jesus come on open up your mouth say in the name of Jesus hallelujah to God David said it that yea though I walk through the valley of the shadow of death I will fear no evil for thou art with me how many of you know that God is in this place today Touch somebody, tell them God is with us. Touch somebody, the presence of the Lord. Come on, the presence of the Lord is in this place. I wish I had a few more persons to testify. 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 You're not talking. You ain't saying nothing. Are you hearing me down there? Tell somebody, the presence of the Lord is in this place. Some of you don't say nothing yet to nobody. I'm looking at you and you're standing staring at me. Look over to somebody and tell them the presence of the Lord is in this place. Say to one more person, the presence of the Lord is in this place. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah, Jesus. Turn with me to the foundation text that was posted Haggai chapter 2 amen we are going to read the whole nine yards verse 1 through verse 9 God has given us this word for the hour and we are going to appreciate it praise God he can give us something that doesn't have the kind of substance to help us along the way praise God when you find it say amen let us read it together. In the seventh month, in the one and twentieth day of the month, came the word of the Lord by the prophet Haggai, saying, Speak now to Zerubbabel, the son of Shethiel, governor of Judah, to Joshua, son of Josedek, the high priest, and to the residue of the people, saying, Who is left among you? That saw this house in her first glory. And how do you see it now? Is it not in your eyes in comparison of the un as nothing? Yet now be strong, O Zerubbabel. Say it, the Lord. Be strong, O Joshua, son of Josedek, high priest. Be strong, all ye people of the land. Say it, the Lord. And work, for I am with you. Say the Lord of hosts. I want to say that again. And work. And work. For I am with you. I am with you. Say the Lord of hosts. Let's continue. Verse 5. According to the word that I have covenanted with you. When ye came out of Egypt. So my spirit remaineth among you. Fear not. For thus say the Lord of hosts. Yet once it is a little while. And I will shake the heavens. And the earth. And the sea and the dry land. And I will shake all nations. And the desire of all nations shall come. And I will fill this house with glory. Say it the Lord of hosts. The silver is mine. And the gold is mine. Say it the Lord of hosts. The glory of this latter house. Shall be greater. Than former. Say it the Lord of hosts. And in this place. Will I give peace. Say it, the Lord of hosts. When you read 
in the Bible and you see, say it, the Lord of hosts. There has to be accomplishments. It means that there is a stamp of approval from the throne of God. There is no way that it is alterable. When God speak a word, he said it shall make accomplishment. It shall not return to me void. Someone then will question just before you sit. What then is in this for me? Was this for the remnant or the residue of those to whom the prophet speaketh? Or does this have anything to do with my apostolic age? Let us go back to the scriptures. That all scriptures, they are good for references, for rebuke, for correction, for enhancement, for edification, for upliftment. And every scripture that is in this book connects one to the other. The same God of that season... Is the same God of the season. God said, I change not. When you see God and he said, I am. It simply means that he is every time, everything, always have been and always will be. And in verse uh, 4, he said, I am the same I am that was with Moses. When Moses went down into Egypt, God reminded them that according to the word that I have covenanted with you when you came out of Egypt. See, God make references. So my spirit remaineth among you, fear not. So he said, I am with you, say yet the Lord of hosts. Do you believe today? That God is with you. Because you can only embrace someone who's standing there. It would be really delusional. To be embracing someone that's not there. Reaching out. But if you believe that the presence... Of God is with us. Yes. Reach over and embrace him. Embrace him with a praise. Embrace him with a worship. Embrace him with appreciation. Embrace him with gratitude. Embrace him with how much you appreciate him for what he's done for you. Is there one more person? Is that all? Is that all? Is that all? Somebody said, look where he brought me from. He brought me from a mighty long way. When I was down. Lord, you raised me. Somebody embrace him again. Well, you have an opportunity, but I suppose that is all the love you have to give. I couldn't help. I couldn't help myself. But reflecting on some of the lines from the love songs that came in my generation. I don't know who really write them because I'm not that good like some of you. But when I read the text, I heard cherish the love. And I know some of you are looking at me funny. I know you know those songs. <laughs> tell somebody, cherish the love. Cherish the love. Come on, tell somebody, cherish the love. Cherish the love. <laughs> I know some of you are looking at me funny. I know you're looking at me funny. Oh, oh, you say, mother, say it again, mother. Say, cherish the love. Then I hear them singing a song. I don't know if you're still Indian or who really write this song. Said, I'll cross the ocean for you. Some of you behave like you're so safe. You're so safe. Jesus is the only one I know. That will cross any ocean for me. So when I embrace him. I said when I embrace him. I'm giving him all the love that I have. Come on somebody. 
I see some of you like, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not going there with some of y'all. I, I can't run that marathon, I'm telling you. But, but I couldn't help myself. But reminding myself of some of what, amen, we use, amen, in our quotation. Especially some of you who are dating. Lord have mercy. Songwriter said, love and mercy found me. Mm? Thank you, sister. That is when you are in the presence of God. And you found a love that no one could have given you while you're in the world. You said love and mercy found me. And you reach over and say hallelujah. And when you love that time, the passion begins to unleash. You know, I think some of us forget what it is to be passionate. After we got saved. The love become today's Sunday, Lord. Thank you. Some must forget what it is to reach over and give someone a gently warm embrace and said hi, how are you? Or to say I love you. How about hugging somebody today? Some of you shaking hands. Look at you. Puppy love. No passion. No embrace. No warmth. Lord have mercy. Love somebody. Tell them cherish the love. I, I can't sing that musician. I can't sing that. I can't sing it. Come on, tell your neighbor, cherish the love. I heard the Bible said, greater love than this that no man. And for a man to lay down his life for his friend. My God. My God. All right, I said, nothing's going to change my love for you. Some of us, our love is changing. Oh, party girl, I tell you. I tell you. I said, some of your love change. The way you used to be excited about Jesus, you change your mind. Lord, have mercy, Jesus. I love him. I love him because he first, he first, he first loved me. me. Come on. And from birth, just my Jesus. We speak the authority of your power. 
over the case. If it's sickness, you have a cure. If it's death, you are the resurrection. We cancel the assignment of Satan. In the name of Jesus, we release apostolic healing in this house right now, God. We come against everything that the enemy has cast over your children. We break the spell of hell. We lose the anointing of God in this house. We claim victory. I said we claim victory. In the name of Jesus. Come on, open your mouth. We claim Hallelujah. victory. In the name of Jesus. Somebody claim victory. In the name of Shout in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Shout in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Shout in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Shout 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 in the name of Jesus. Plead the blood of Jesus, somebody. 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 Plead the blood of Jesus in this house. Some of you not open up the mouth. You shut your mouth. The more we are together, it's more power. Shout the blood, 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 the blood of Jesus. And we decree Jesus and we declare that there's healing and there's deliverance in this house. There's restoration. We cancel off everything. We come against it now. Yes. We come against every bondage. We break it in the name of Jesus. I want a church that know how to pray and to war. I say I need a church who know how to pray and to war. I don't need an idle church. I need a church who can war. Koshata Messiah. I need a war in church. I need a church who know when to raise up against the attack of the enemy. I need a church that can war in the spirit. Come on in the name of Jesus. Come on in the name of Jesus. It's not time to look around like Alice in Wonderland. It's time to stand on your authority. It's time to stand in the blood of Jesus. It's time to stand in the anointing of God. It's time to agree in the spirit. It's time to cry out to God. It's time to worship in the spirit. Somebody open up your mouth. Somebody Jesus. open up your mouth. Jesus. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost. Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, Marco Sata, Shata Nabosia, Robosia Kotosha, Mama Masata, Koto Shanda, Yako Sata, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, victory shall be ours, victory Jesus. shall be mine, victory, victory, victory. Jesus. Somebody shout victory. victory. Somebody shout victory. Victory. Oh, victory. Victory shall be mine. Oh, victory. Victory shall be mine. If I hold my peace, let the Lord fight my battle. Victory. Victory shall be mine. Put your hands together. Oh, victory. Victory shall be mine.
Bishop, I want these people to yeah. know what they're walking to. They're walking to glory today. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Right now. 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 I want you to behave yourself. Hallelujah. Behave yourself right now. You're worthy, I, I, I'm, I'm behaving myself. I'm behaving myself. Hallelujah. You know what I could do right now, but I'm going to behave myself. I'm my God. Right now. 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 We have read the text. Thank you, Jesus. So many things right now. happen. Since we read the text, talk about cherish the Lord. So many things shift up in the spirit that I could preach anything. Woo! But when I look at what we're talking about, we're looking at God Himself. When we say glory, otherwise we say God. Yes. We say Jesus. When we say glory, we actually say Holy Ghost. When we say glory, we say majesty. Yeah. When we say glory, we say power. Yeah. We say manifestation of God. Yeah. We say miracle working yes. God. We say mighty working power. We said, God, you're great. When you say glory, I said, God, you're wonderful. wonderful. When you say glory, I said, God, you're, you're awesome. awesome. When you say glory, I said, you're a healer. healer. Every time you say glory, you display the character of who God is. Woo. Every time you say glory, you speak of the revelation of who God is. When you say glory, you're talking about the essence and character of God's revelation and manifestation. So glory is not just the word that beautifies it's not just the word that elevates glory is the very essence of who God is God is the God of glory you cannot have glory except you know God all the world they have uh, all different kind of forms uh, that they create and call it a glorified form but you truly don't know glory until you know God 
and if you know who God is then God said my glory will I not give to another and then you I can't help it but move beyond the era of Haggai because the God that we serve he's the God of yesterday he's the God of today and he's the God of tomorrow he's Alpha and he is Omega he is the beginning and he is the end you cannot talk about glory and refer to yourself i know that there are many areas of life where folks have claimed that when you embrace the glory you are speaking about that which is on top the on top potential that is in you but if there is any on top potential that is god himself how many you know that there's a greater glory to be experienced in god there's another dimension of glory locked up in god that people PTA have not seen. Come on here, somebody. And that if you understand the glory of God, there ought to be a revelation. There ought to be an expectation. Are you hearing me, somebody? Now, if you come in here, you have no expectation for another dimension of miracle, then you do not understand truly the glory of God. You must understand that there is another level of revelation. Something that God is about to do that we have not seen yet. Don't be troubled about what's happening around here. It is happening because the enemy wants to distract us from the glory of God. But we will not be distracted. We know that God has everything worked out in his own power and is his own time. Somebody give God praise. So if you want to sit down, it's up to you. We're going to talk about God just a little bit more. When we talk about glory, then you got to look back into the beginning. The beginning said, the word said, in the beginning was God. No, no, no. God created. Hold on a second. Because I want to talk to you about when I say that we should cherish this love that what God is is nothing but pure love come on somebody and if you want to embrace uh, it means you're going to cherish and if you cherish it means you're going to hug you're going to get an intimate relationship with God amen and so the Bible then look and show us God in his glory now if God dwells in the north I don't know but based uh, on the writer he speaks to God in the north now somebody said he's throne that might be setting up uh, in the north ward of the heavenlies. Uh, nevertheless, he said heaven is his throne and earth is his footstool. But one time we were told in the Bible, amen, that there was a praise and worship service in heaven. Hallelujah to God. And that's why you have to be very careful when we come into the worship session. For there is the devil knows how to disrupt a good worship session. The devil knows how to intervene and comes in and disrupt the service ah somebody said well there's too much anointing in here so the devil can't disrupt but he disrupt heaven can I talk to somebody here he disrupt the service in heaven he disrupt God's service where the praises were going up and the glory was going up to God Satan disrupted heaven and he even convinced a group in heaven to say come my way and agree with me to all overthrow God and to set up my kingdom and to take the seat of God every time that the devil see that God is about to get glory he gets upset that's why I say to the church you have to be watchful and understand it's a trick from the devil to rob God from his glory to steal from God but in the name of Jesus what belongs to God today God is going to get and the devil will get nothing that belongs to God God. Somebody give God praise in this house. Give God praise in this house. Touch your neighbor and tell them, give him glory. Shake your hand and say, I'm going to give God glory. In spite of your circumstance, in spite of your situation, in spite of what's going through your mind right now, some of you asking yourself some questions. Is this the way that life's supposed to be? But tell your neighbor, I don't care about that right now. I'm here to give God glory. What I'm feeling in my body. Is this okay for me to feel the way I feel? That's not my concern right now. My concern is to give God glory. For God can take everything in my life. And everything in my body. And turn it around for his glory. 
somebody give God praise in this house. Look at your name and say, neighbor, don't be distracted. Don't be disrupted. Don't be frustrated by what the enemy trying to do. He's trying to steal the glory of God. But whatever hell that the devil put on you, use it and navigate your way to heaven. And let the devil know that God is in charge of whatever goes on in your life. Somebody give God praise. Even if it's sickness in my body, I'm still giving God glory. Troubles in my home, I'm still giving God glory. Problems on my job, I'm still giving God glory. I'm broke and have no money, I'm still giving God glory. My world is turned upside down, I'm still giving God glory. I'm at the crossroad, I can't find my way, I'm still giving God glory. I'm sad and lonely, I'm still giving God glory. Troubles on every hand, I'm still giving God glory. Folks talking about me, I'm still giving God glory. They're looking at me funny, but I'm still giving God glory. Open up your mouth and tell your neighbor, doesn't matter what your circumstances might be, you got glory. Release that glory. Now I'm not saying to you that what God puts in you, the devil wants to take out. But if God puts something in you, the devil have no business taking it up. He put joy in you. Hold on to your joy and embrace the glory. He put peace in you. Hold on to your peace. He gave you your health. Somebody say, hold on. Look at your neighbor and say, hold on. He tried to break your faith. Tell somebody, I believe God. In good times and bad times, I still believe God. Even when the money dry up, I still believe God. Even when everything break down around me, I still believe God. Somebody said, Lord, you are the God of glory. Open your mouth. Push your head back. Shout glory. Shout glory. So now I heard John said now that in the beginning God created for the glory of God is manifested in the creation when God created um, the world and earth was without form and void uh, when God called you as a new creature you were without form and void confusion was in the life uh, of every sinner uh, and it looked like none of us knew where we were going um, but when God called us uh, the spirit wrought a work on us uh, the spirit of the Lord uh, gets over your body breathe over you do a work in you uh, set you upright uh, set you on your right path uh, change your mind uh, and bring you into your right mind uh, remove all the confusion uh, and discombobulation uh, and gave you a place uh, of rest and peace uh, the devil have no business uh, disturbing your rest uh, the devil have no business uh, disturbing your peace uh, look at the neighbor say neighbor uh, I've got the mind of Christ uh, and the devil can't take it away from me I wish I have three persons in this house uh, who know that he's the God of your creation uh, he wrought a work in me uh, tell your neighbor I wasn't like this uh, but he picked me up he turned me around plant my feet and higher ground uh, somebody say yes Lord uh, feel your glory I feel your glory the devil don't want you praise him push your mouth up open up your mouth and shout glory shout glory I don't feel like it but glory I don't look like it but I'm still giving God glory why because in the creation he brought the which was not uh, as if it were and there are some things in this season that God's getting ready to bring in you don't see it yet but God's getting ready to release it tell your neighbor neighbor it's been
been revealed but not yet released somebody give God praise in this house stretch yourself and said I can see it I heard the songwriter said my eyes have seen the glory of the coming of the Lord look at the neighbor tell them glory cometh shout and say glory cometh and it won't be long I'm not just gonna stay here but I'll find me a song I'm gonna find me a shout I'm gonna have some church somebody stamp your feet and give God glory said I'm not gonna stay here and act like I'm dead God put a life in me and he said live and I'm gonna live and occupy until he come so that's what God said to the prophet don't you just sit there and worry about what went wrong don't worry about what you lost don't worry about what didn't work out look in the future things are gonna get better shake a hand and give God praise the things are going to get better do I have a few crazy persons in here said it will get better it shall get better so prophesy over your life prophesy over your ministry prophesy over your spirit prophesy over your money prophesy over your family prophesy over your house slap somebody say I prophesy over you things are gonna get better say it will get better say cry on it's your last tears weeping may endure but one more night look at somebody say one more night but joy show joy coming in the morning somebody start dancing like you know your joy is coming just start shouting like you know your joy is coming clap your hands if you have to shout the praise if you have to but joy 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 ah, yes God hey, hey. somebody give God praise so golden is glory in creation his glory in revelation his glory in transformation when it look like there is no way huh? he know how to make a way huh? for his people huh? was trapped in Egypt huh? and the devil said I got my foot in your neck huh? and you shall never get out huh? but I heard God said to Moses huh? Moses Moses huh? go down to Egypt huh? tell King Pharaoh huh? let my people go huh? Moses said who is it huh? that sent me huh? when I get down there huh? what must I tell them God said Moses huh? tell them I am that I am look at the neighbor said neighbor huh? anything you want him to be huh? he'll be to you huh? you want him to be a lover huh? reach out and embrace him huh? you want him to be a comforter huh? reach out and embrace him you want him to be an encourager huh? lean over and lean on him he said lean on me huh? somebody said lean in safe and secure huh? from all alarm God get on down into Egypt Bishop huh? when he get on down into Egypt huh? Pharaoh thought huh? he had the best magic huh? but when God get ready huh? Ah, the up your worker the witchcraft worker the witch of Hartford have to back up somebody said back up witch plead the blood of Jesus said back up your witch we lose the heavenly we lose the atmosphere robo satai somebody glorify God shatataku satai why a bubble sito open up your mouth and said back up witch we come against you in the name of Jesus we come against you by the blood of Jesus we come against you and throw the word of God throw the blood somebody 
draw the blood somebody draw the blood all over Hartford I wish I have two crazy person run out in the parking lot run out in the parking lot huh? and throw the blood of Jesus huh? get outside in the parking lot huh? and say the blood the blood the blood the blood huh? Rato Satai Rabo Siko Shatai Rabo Koshatai Some of you need to elevate in the spirit It's a warfare Paul said You walk in the flesh But you war in the spirit There's a warfare going on But the weapons Of a warfare Are not carnal But mighty Through God To the pulling down Pulling down a stronghold. I want to pull them down. Say, pull them down. You stronghold. You're coming down. Stronghold of oppression. Stronghold of depression. Stronghold of bad economy. Stronghold of job loss. Tell them you're coming down. You fortress of Satan. You fortress of the warlocks. You fortress of the witches. Shout the blood of Jesus. Said every stronghold that's against the church. God wants to birth a revival. But there's a stronghold. He wants to raise the dead. But there's a stronghold. He wants to work some miracles. But there's a stronghold. He wants to raise the church to another level. But there's a stronghold. But tell your enemy. Back away from here. The angel of God is encamping round about PTA. I need some warriors. Who's the angels of God? Take your position. Fire. Fire. Say fire. Wow. Shut over. I feel the Holy Ghost. Say fire. Burn around this place. Burn in this place. Fire of God. Burn in this place. Say fire. I need some warriors. Say fire. Burn. Right up in this place. Make up your fire, God. Make up your fire, God. Make up your fire. Shut those. Shut fire. Shut fire. We're talking about glory. Shut glory. The glory is the fire. The glory is the fire. Where the fire is, the glory is. Where the glory is, the fire is. If there is glory, there has to be fire. On the mount, there was a fire. The bush was burning, but was not consumed. For in the fire, what's the glory? You are struggling, but the devil can't get rid of you. You are going through persecution, but you still preserve. For what's around you is nothing but fire. And the fire is the glory. Shout glory. I soon give you the money. Shout glory. Shout glory. That is why when you come into an apostolic church, you must be on fire. There must be fire. The Bible said when an unclean spirit is gone out of a man, he left the house empty, sweet and clean, but he's coming back looking for his all aboard. When he gets back, if the house is empty and no fire in there, he call up his wicked friends. Step back in there. But tell your neighbor, neighbor, ain't no demon coming up in me. I got the fire. Shut I got the fire. Shut up, Boko Sata. Shut up, Boko Sata. Yabba Boko Sata. Boko Sata, Yabba. Stir up your Holy Ghost. Stir up your fire. Stir up your anointing. Stir up your power. Stir it up. You can't keep quiet. You can't shut up. You got to be on fire. Fire. Shut fire. You got to have the fire burn. You got to have the fire. The fire has to burn. Somebody said burning fire. Shut burning fire. Shut burning fire. What on Saturday? You must have the fire. Demons will come back. 
lock up back in your belly somebody shot fire I would have three more persons you got to keep the fire you got to get the fire you got to have the fire you got to let the fire burn shot fire moving your feet must be moving you must talk some language you must have a shout for when the day of Pentecost was fully come they were all in one place in one accord suddenly suddenly there came from heaven the glory I said the glory in the being of fire like a rushing mighty wind somebody said blow wind blow blow wind Shut up, love it. Somebody have the fire down. Somebody have the fire over there. Do you have the fire, honey? Do you have the fire? Do you have the fire? Do you have the fire? How about you, brother? Just say fire. Fire. Say fire. Fire. Do you want the fire? Shut the bowl, sicko shot. Fire! Don't turn away. Shut fire. Shut fire. church need to understand what we have we have the Holy Ghost it's the glory of God it's the fire of God it's the authority of God it's the power of God you shut off your anointing you shut down the glory if there's no glory the devil gonna kill you devil gonna kill you you better stir up the glory stir up the Holy Ghost Grab on to it. Hold on to it. Embrace the glory. Why? Shut up. For glory. 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 I hope I didn't lost the bishop. Church. You got to embrace this. The glory of God. In creation, yeah. revelation, yeah. as he unfolded himself yeah. and revealed himself yeah. to the patriarchs and the prophets. Fire was everywhere he showed up. Yeah. Showed up with Abraham, fire showed. Oh, yeah. Showed up with Moses, fire showed. Yeah. Came down on, showed up with Israel, fire showed. Yeah. Wherever God's presence is, there has to be fire. Yeah. We need more fire. We need more fire. Shot fire. Shot fire. Shot fire. Shot fire. Shot fire. 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 Wow. Bubble shot. I go shot out of a bubble. That goes to total of a bubble. In the name of Jesus. Bro. 
Robo Sata Robo Sata Robo Sata Robo Kushandio Sata The blood of Jesus Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Yes, Lord, hallelujah. Come on, just plead the blood of Jesus. Hallelujah. In the name of oh, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. In the name so of we give Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. 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 Nobody like you, God. Glory. Satan, the Lord, the name of you Jesus. Name of Jesus. Your life Hallelujah. Spirit. Let her get up. The blood get up. Get, up. get up. The blood of get Jesus. Get up. In the name of Jesus. Get up. The blood of Jesus. The name of Jesus. We're talking about. Hallelujah. You're getting up. You're getting up in, in Jesus' name. Jesus. You're in getting up in Jesus, Jesus' name. Somebody worship God. Worship God. Jesus. Worship God. Hallelujah. Worship God. Worship God. Worship God. Worship God. Worship God. No weapon. Strong against us shall prosper. In the name of Jesus. Open up your mouth and worship God. She shall not die. In the name of Jesus. I said she shall not die. Jesus. But she shall live. Jesus. And declare the work of the Lord. Jesus. Somebody give God glory. Jesus. No weapon. Of Jesus. No weapon. No weapon. No weapon. No weapon. Rabo Sata. Rabo Sata. Jesus. We release the apostolic anointing. She's well. The blood. Jesus. I said she's well. In the name of I say Andrea is well. Yeah. Somebody give God glory. Hallelujah. This time. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Worship God. The blood of Jesus. Worship God. Thank you. Worship God. Hallelujah. Worship God. Hallelujah. God, you're worthy. You're worthy. Worship God. Glory to your name. Some of you like worshiping God. Glory to your name. Glory. Hallelujah. In the name Jesus. of Jesus. Glory. Holy Ghost. Glory. In the name of Jesus. She's well. Hallelujah. With a creed, she's well. Somebody worship God. Hallelujah. Somebody give God glory. glory. Somebody give God praise. Hallelujah. Somebody tell God thank you. Glory. Andrea is well. It shall be well. Clap your hands and give God praise. Glory. Show glory in this house. Show glory in this house. Glory. Look at the neighbor, say neighbor. It's just a test. It's just a test. Say neighbor. Neighbor. It's a test of your faith. Tell somebody it's for the glory of God. Oh. And all things are working together for good to them who love God. Now call according to his purpose. You just praise God. Oh. You just praise God. Glory. You just worship God. Hallelujah. You just give God glory. You just give God praise. Hallelujah. Everybody give God praise. Glory. Everybody give God glory. glory. Clap your hands and give God praise. Open your mouth glory. and give God praise. Bishop is going to come, but watch this. When things like these happen in the church, 
which we have seen all the time. We have seen them dead and come back to life. We know that there's a protocol because we're dealing with the law also. And if we didn't call the paramedic, they wouldn't come. And we understand what we have to do. But I want nobody in this church to think otherwise than that God's glory yes. is being revealed in this house. Nothing that happened to Andrea is by chance. I said nothing that happened to Andrea is by chance. The only thing, in Jamaica we don't have this luxury. That as we call the paramedic, they show up. So we have to go and call Jesus until That's right. him show up. That's right. But because some of we know we have such a good Medicare yes. and medical system. Yes. We trust and we believe. Yes. And, we, and, and I'm not ignorant. I'm not ignorant. But no one in this house should fret or worry. We have decreed it. I prayed Friday night because I saw something. And I said, we rebuke death. And when I stood up in this pulpit, I prayed again today. I pray against death. As I stepped into this pulpit, there was a sensation that Jezebel was visiting. And that's why you got to, you got to stay in the spirit line. Who shall about Sata? I said, Jezebel sent a death sentence. Kushata. For the pulpit. But it stopped at the door. Rabba Sataya. Rako Soto Rabba Lord God, I, I, I'm going to get a Rako Shata. I said, Jezebel sent a death sentence for your pulpit this morning. But because God told us how the word of God trained us to be a wise master builder. We stay here and do the warfare. And send back the attack. That's why when you come to church, you feel ready up yourself. You feel come with a praise. Even if you're not saved, come with a praise. And if you're saved, you must have a worship. You're not I said you must have a worship. And that's why I said, when the unclean spirit gone, Fill up your house with praise. Yes. Fill it up with the fire of God. Yes. For when the dragon come back, he coming back home. Arm yes. and ready yes. to slaughter. Yes. Look here. The spirit been visiting God's church. Took out one down in New Jersey. Or somewhere down that side. No, take no note here. You're not hearing me. I say it's not happening. I said it's not happening. I decree it and I declare it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I said we decree it and declare it in the name of Jesus. Be death and sicknesses and diseases and these evil dramas and pandemonium. Die from PTA. Somebody better touch your seat and say the blood on sit down. Slap your chair, shout the blood and sit down. Slap it, say the blood of Jesus. Said no death, no drama, no pandemonium. None of these things shall have dominion over me. Somebody shout glory. Shout glory in this house. Give God glory in this house. Hey! Sata. Whoa! 
out the spirit. Drive out the spirit. Cover somebody. The blood. Stretch your hand over somebody. The blood. Reach out and touch somebody. The blood. Plead the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. 